your YouTube is your boy artist, and I'm back with another video. You feel me? So by the title and the thumbnail, you already know what we're getting into. So pretty much, if you're just like me, uh, just started streaming on Kick. Um, you know, changing the stream titles if you're switching between games could be really annoying, and you know, people like to do it inside of OBS. Now, since Kick is still in the beta, we don't have no way to really change the stream info unless we do it through the chrome tab but i have found a way that might still be a little bit stressful but it'll be better than switching between the chrome and to get back into your obs and look at your chat as you can see on the left and the right of me so um right we're gonna start right with uh docs you gotta go to custom browser docs and you want to make sure you go to you want to type the doc name as kick.com and you want to put kick.com inside of it and then you want to hit apply now i'm already logged in but what i'm pretty much just telling you is to make sure you're logged in if you are still having trouble with trying to put up kick chats please check out mr c paul's music this video right here teaches you how to put the chat yeah uh, he also teaches you how to put um alerts he not he teach you how to put all the chat bots all those type of things that you would normally have on like twitch youtube and stuff like that he will teach you so shout out to c paul for being a big help but He's going to be the, he, his videos is pretty much the first part of this little segment right here. So now when you sign in, you're just going to back out of that. You can close that. You're just going to delete this doc. And you're just going to close this out, right? So when you sign in on his video, he told you when he signs in, instead of disconnect, the chat will pop up as for you to type in. So you can see me type in now, but if you are new to doing the kick chats whatever you will have to sign in for the disconnect part to not disconnect so when uh, his video will be in this link in the description you will see how to put up your chat and see how to get the disconnect uh, part away so after you sign in you're going to want to put the kick dashboard here you're going to want to put the dashboard you want to copy this link and you're going to want to paste it into the custom docs on a custom docs you want to i just i titled it kick stream and then we're also just going to put it here again so you can see and you're going to hit apply so now when you hit apply this thing will pop up so i'm going to refresh this right now when, when it pops up it's going to show this so pretty much it's going to show the dashboard so pretty much what you have to do is keep zooming out so you just want to close all of these out so just how you would normally see it but just for right now you want to close it out right so when you bump all these out you won't be able to see anything so then when you zoom out one more time, you're going to see the little edit stream info on the top. You're going to click that. Now, artists, it's so small. How are you going to get this? So what you want to do is right click anywhere and then you want to reset the zoom. Once you reset the zoom, it pops up clearly. And as you can see, when you click into it, you can type into it. All right. And this is the way that I found out how to switch the stream info inside of OBS. Uh, this little process is, is kind of annoying. But um, if you're like me, you're going to want to do this instead of always switching between a Chrome. If you're playing music, if you're the type of person to play music in your background streams, but you're not always switching your stream titles, I think this will be good because you're not going to always be in the Chrome. You're only going to probably be in the Chrome just to look at uh, switch the music that you're playing or just tab people. So um, pretty much this is the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Please follow the kick if you're new to this, new to this video. And please follow channel if you knew please so much we're on the road to 1000 subscribers we're on the road to, uh, to 1000 followers on kick and twitch even though we might be making the switch to kick so just please follow the streams down below please follow all the socials i love y'all stay safe peace